17 Locker Art here in Ferrybank. This is a gorgeous four stroke five bedroom home. Come on in and we'll have a look around. Now we just stepped into the entrance hallway, but to the front there is some garden space and also a driveway, a tarmac driveway, which can accommodate two cars. Also within the estate, there's a lot of um, spaces for communal parking as well. This seems to be a very well planned out estate, but let's have a look at the living room first. Now I love this room because it has a bay window and it also has this fireplace and it leads into a gorgeous dining room come kitchen area as well. But just taking in this living room with beautiful flooring and these French doors that open up into the dining space. Now this home was built in approximately 2007. And it's a substantial home, I think it's over 1,500 square foot, so there's lots of space in this house. Really well apportioned accommodation. You can see here behind me, we've got this beautiful cream fitted kitchen. Lots of space here for dining table, like we've six chairs. This room can take substantial furniture. And there's also an alcove here for an American style fridge with a wine rack above it, very important. Let's have a look at the back garden. Now this is a great back garden. We've got a patio area here, ideal for some al fresco dining or a barbecue. You have a lawn area. And then just over here, we've got a block built shed. Now this is a great addition because we all know building costs have soared and to build an actual block built sh shed at the moment, I don't know what it would cost, but it wouldn't be cheap. It's brilliant to have this here. It's ideal for your garden equipment, your bikes, a workshop, anything you need. And then just drawing your attention. So the boundary is surrounded by these beautiful mature trees. So we're completely private here, we're not overlooked. This is a great space for a bit of uh, peace and calm. Let's pop in again and we'll have a look at the kitchen. So just back into the kitchen, and I love the tiles in the hallway in the kitchen. They're porcelain type tile, they bounce light around the place. This home is truly in walking condition. But there's more to see here because we've got a utility room and a downstairs bathroom. Now, just behind me as well, of course, we have a side door that goes out to the side of the house. And in the utility room, we've built in presses. And then we've got this fine sized bathroom as well. There is nothing small about this home. Lots and lots of space. Let's go back out to the hallway because we've got a second living room, which is currently in use as a fifth bedroom. And I want to give you a look at it. Now we're out into the hallway again, lovely big bright hallway, storage space under the stairs and then to this room here, as I said, currently in use as a fifth bedroom but can be a second living room, a den for the kids, a home office, playroom, can be multi-functions. Let's move upstairs. Now upstairs, we've got four double bedrooms. Yes, you've heard me right, we've got four double bedrooms. And we've an ensuite, main bathroom, walk-in wardrobe, this house has it all. So we've just stepped into one of the double bedrooms here. It overlooks the back garden. And then through here, we've got a walk-in wardrobe. So we've a sliding door, so this door slides, and you have this large walk-in wardrobe. Now, possibly somebody could explore putting an ensuite in here because the space is there. You'd have to get you know advice off your plumber or your electrician. But the master bedroom has an ensuite any, but anyway, let's go out and have a look at the main bathroom. So again, we're out into the landing and you won't see it now, but there's a large um, ceiling window, like a Velux window that goes right up to the roof, leaving great light in through the landing. And here we are in the bathroom, electric shower, bath in the bathroom, very important for some of us. And now this is the second double room. So this is a fine big room and it also has built-in wardrobes. We give you a look at the built-in wardrobes now. Still have two more bedrooms to see. So back out into the hallway. We have an off hot press as well in the hallway. And then this is the master bedroom. Now this is a fine big room and it has that lovely bay window, which is great for giving that extra bit of space. So it's a large bedroom. I think this could be a king size bed, super king bed. It's quite large anyway. Didn't bring my measuring tape with me, 
We've loads of built-in storage here. So we've got a uh, fitted wardrobe for three doors. We've got shelving unit built in. And then we've got this great ensuite. And I love the tiles in the ensuite. Now let's pop back out to the hallway because we've the last double room to look at. Now this double bedroom has a built-in bed frame into the room and the storage underneath it. And then what's also really clever is you can lift these sections up here and you've got more storage here. So ideal use of space. Space has been cleverly maximized throughout this property. Let's go back downstairs. I just want to give you one more look at the kitchen. This is a very quiet residential estate. Not many houses have come up here for sale, so I'm assuming a lot of the people that live in the estate at the moment probably are the original owners. As I said, very few houses come up for, this, for sale in this estate. People seem to really like living here. So this is a gorgeous home, as you can see. Um, we have more information on our website, libertyblue.ie. You can download floor plans, have a look at the virtual tour, and so on, and find out more information about this property. It's just gone on the market with a guide price of 265,000 euro. Now that's exceptional value for money, considering this is a four stroke, five bedroom house. It has a block built garage, a private garden, not overlooked, a double driveway to the front. At the front of the estate, there's a bus service that runs to the city centre on a frequent basis, six days a week. You're within walking distance to two primary schools, a secondary school, in Ferrybank, there's GA, the soccer, the scouts. There's so many amenities here for any family in this neighbourhood. Also, just to point out, there is going to be a new greenway going from Waterford to Wexford, and the entrance to it is over in the Abbey Park area, which is literally only a five or 10 minute walk here. So that's something really nice that's coming down the tracks for the future, pardon the pun. If you're interested in this house, give us a call on 051 85 8182 or direct message me on this page. Thanks for watching. Mm -hmm.